Uh, for any farmer who is interested in growing mushrooms, he needs to go to uh, a university. We have universities that are producing spawn. And we also have individuals that are properly trained and uh, have uh, um, facilities for producing high quality spawn, uh, including myself. We can also exp import, but for sustainability and reduction of cost of production, we encourage that farmers can even venture into uh, spawn multiplication so that uh, they are able to reduce on their costs. And this is uh, not a very complicated technology. They can be trained and be able to produce their spawn, provided their demand for spawn is high, because it will be an economical to produce spawn when you only need so little for yourself. One of the things that I like about this enterprise is that it creates employment. It is high value income crop because a kilo of mushrooms will go for between 400 shillings to 600 shillings depending on the market. When you look at, uh, when you compare other local crops produced in this area like beans, a kilogram of beans is about 80 shillings. When you look at maize, a kilogram is about 20 shillings. When you look at sugarcane, it's actually 4 shillings per kilo. So, this is a crop that needs to be promoted and to be encouraged for improvement of livelihoods within the urban and the rural community. The inputs for mushroom production are low. Perhaps the only input that is um, uh, is uh, a bit high is the housing which requires uh, timber, it requires iron sheets but once you have done that bit of it then the rest of it is low input.